And David and Ellen, we are along part of the route of the LA Marathon. Back in March, one of the runners was a 70 year old retired doctor who performed so well it caught the attention of a marathon investigator. We were born to run. We were not designed to be sitting couches watching television. Dr. Frank Mesa, a retired physician, talking about the benefits of a healthy lifestyle. He's been an avid runner, uh, very competitive. The 70 year old runner entering the LA Marathon. For his age group, his performance record setting, or so it seemed, until marathon investigator Derek Murphy says he took a closer look and found video that shows he left the course. What you see is that he, you know, comes on the course after being along the sidewalk for a period of an unknown period of time. Um, I looked back again six minutes, and he was never on the portion of the course leading up to the sidewalk. So it showed me that he never. Um, you know, didn't run that full part of the course. The LA Marathon says it has disqualified Mesa for allegedly cheating. His time of two hours, 53 minutes, and 10 seconds scrapped. The person behind him, now the winner, finished in four hours, 10 minutes, and seven seconds. Until I get more deeper understanding, I support Frank. Mesa founded Azatlan Track Club in 1974. That's how Jose Zavala says he got to know him years later. Zavala runs the Azatlan Athletics, which helps organize and run community-based events. He says he's not yet convinced Mesa cheated. Based on when I see him running on the trails, just based on his training, he's fit. He's in incredible shape. Mesa's team issued a statement saying, in due time, he will set the record straight and address all of the allegations. Now, it's just not the right time. But Mesa's other marathon times are now under scrutiny, including the 2019 Sprouts Mesa Phoenix Marathon, which says it's now investigating his finish time. A statement reads in part, the Sprouts Mesa Phoenix Marathon will take swift and necessary action following the conclusion of our investigation. We are very serious about doing our part to ensure the integrity of our sport. Now, Dr. Mesa also coached uh, cross country at Loyola High School. The school says that he stepped down in June due to health reasons and because his disqualification from the LA Marathon has nothing to do with the school, the school says it has no comment. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Click the ABC7 logo to subscribe to our Eyewitness News YouTube channel.